Price from Eden Condensed Small Space Garden Design. And this is garden space. You're probably wondering why I'm standing here with my tea kettle. Well, it's not tea time. I'm going to show you how to get rid of ants without using any kind of pesticides. Now, I don't like ants. I don't like them in my house. I don't like them in my garden, but ants are actually, they actually serve a purpose and that they're kind of nature's little trash trucks and that they'll carry off debris and um, they really aren't gonna eat your plants at all. So if there aren't too many ants, you really don't need to do much of anything with them. But if you happen to find an ant colony or an ant hill that you're digging up uh, to plant your gardens, you may want to get rid of them. Part of the, the uh, key to it is finding the queen. So you may need to dig down, which is not going to be pretty. But the best way to get rid of ants or any kind of other bugs and, or even weeds is to use boiling water, um, is to heat up a kettle of water and pour it on where the ants are. Now don't pour them on your tomato plants because you'll actually kill the tomato plants. But if you pour the hot water around where the ants are, it will actually go ahead and I'm afraid to say just cook them. Um, if you happen to have an ant hill, what you'll want to do is pour the water in, dig it up, pour some more water in, and you should get rid of most of the ants. Um, since you flooded out their colony, then they'll pick up and, and move someplace else. So if you have any other questions about how to get rid of ants from your tomato plants or any other uh, parts of your vegetable garden without using any chemicals, uh, please contact me at www.edencondensed.com. Thank you very much.